Majima, I am ready for this sadism. Up with Woody Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89. Today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for um, Eden Zero Chapter 32. So, um, last chapter, we got a, uh, a warning that this arc is going to get sadistic, and I'm really excited. And I'm hoping it's going to be as bad or worse than like what we've seen in Attack on Titan, Kimetsu no Yaiba, uh, Nanatsu no Taze to an extent. Um, and hell, even Fairy Tale. Fairy Tale had some. Fairy Tale got sadistic at times. Um, I'm hoping we're going to get something more extreme than this. I really want to see Mashima just go all out, um, especially since we've seen a lot of his kinky, uh, or his kinkiness uh, lately. Anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. Oh, um, hello. Y'all have bad sleeping habits. <laughs> so cute and who's who's happy with this fish and a fucking wise with his booty up in the air i should say her booty and then fucking um shiki just like on um on rebecca and um and homura's just like homura sleeps really weird what the hell homura um the bonds with friends uh shines in the vast outer space the first um magnitude star and this chapter is titled jamaroth the murderer Ooh, yes, we saw that motherfucker at the end of last week's chapter. So there's Hermit. Hermit, I can't believe you would close off your heart. What in the world happened? Your soul will be saved by the Demon King no matter what, so please. Witch, come look at this. It seems some strange data is running through our line. We've been hacked? Mas Masquid? Who hacked them? Ethan Zero Security is um, top of the line, but that's only when Hermit was around. I don't know what they're up to, but if we do nothing and something bad happens, there might be uh, some side effects to the, uh, those in Digitalis. Well, duh, we already kind of knew that because we're because Mashima is taking us in a sword our line direction here. Meanwhile, in Digitalis, let's go to the town north of here where Hermit is. That information is a one hundred percent reliable. I can't believe this is what a fancy world feels like. Does the professor want to ride? <laughs> Um, I can't believe in this virtual uh, world you can feel and smell things. It's just how real this world is built. All we need now is some monsters to battle. Ooh, speak of the devil. You had to jinx it. It's here. Uh, there was one of these in Granba, although it was just a machine. No one ever came, so it, it never really got used. This monster must be happy. I mean, I could totally annihilate this thing, right? I guess so. Um, here we go. Here we go. Um, please stop. Um, just a moment. Whoa there, traveler. It talked. What? I am not an evil monster, kind sirs. You sure? But wait, since I'm an event boss, maybe I am evil? In the town north of here, Krista will hold a crest for a stolen hidden jewel. Adventurers will find uh, will need to find the jewel and return it to the cave at which I live. However, in a heartwarming story, I use that jewel to protect the people. Oh, I can't believe I just spoiled it. Ugh. We've got no interest anyways. He got all depressed. It's fine. We don't care. Dude. Weiss. The savageness. Why would the boss be in a place like this? That's right, Krista, the town north of us is in deep trouble. It was only a rumor, but it turns out to be true. Jamaroff the murderer, he appeared in town, and oh, right now he looks so fucking awesome. He looks creepy as hell, I love it. A murderer? What a strange name. He just kills players and NPCs without a second thought. He's a very terrible guy. Is that guy a player too? It would seem so. Wouldn't that result in a uh, ban if he killed an NPC? But somehow this player doesn't get banned. Thanks to him, Krista was totally destroyed, and it was such a beautiful town before. All of the players and NPCs were killed. Even the event flag um, crumbled to pieces, too. That's why I ran away from there as fast as I could. God, just, ugh, just thinking about it gives me, it gives me chills. Um, we're trying to find a girl named Hermit in the northern towns. This girl, do you know about her? Do you mean the player that, um, uh, do you mean that, pl uh, that, ah, warnings. Do you mean that player who just stares off? You know her? Yeah, she just sits there and does nothing. Oh, Hermit, really? Really, Hermit? Oh, my God. I see her on a hill in the outskirts of the village quite often. That's awesome. Hermit is really there. Thank you so much, Monster Son. If there's someone weird wandering around, we better get a move on. Right. Um, you guys are going to Krista? That place is already... Uh, we're going to pick up our friend. Uh, there's nowhere we wouldn't go. Monster's just, like, looking at them like, Ah, oh, you guys are fucking weird. You guys are just asking to die. The town of Crystal Krista. What a terrible sight. There's no one around. No, there's someone over there. Welcome to the beautiful Crystal Town of Krista. Welcome to the beautiful Crystal Town of Krista. Oh my god. We got our, we got the animal moment here, but 
This this motherfucker ain't ain't Thanos. We we got our Thanos in um, Fairy Tale One Hundred Years Quest. Majima, you're trying to bring Thanos up in here too, really? Um, welcome. That's why NPCs are so bad. You can always tell they're just programs. No good at all. Woo, we just deleted her. Deleted. Um, if I do go hunting, it's gotta be Player Zoo. <laughs> right? Oh, you Player Zoo. Yeah. Ooh, I love this design. Ooh, I love it, I love it, I love it. And it's creepy. There's the, we got like a goblin feature, goblin features going on in this guy. Oh, where's Goblin Slayer when you need him? But dude, I love the mohawk we're, we're rocking, the goo jazz nose. Ooh, it's just, ooh, awesome, awesome, awesome. This guy can't be that rumored murderer. Just listen, um, just listen here. Since I heard a few players just arrived in Digitalis, I thought of coming to greet you, but ended up in the wrong town. It was so terrible. It must have been a veteran player who looked like a gorilla's party house. Wait a minute. So, oh, they did it. They, they, um, so this motherfucker was hacking the system, um, or, you know, the system to get to them real fast, but no, which in them, um, and I should say Moskoy, because that's who really do it. Uh, stop that shit. Yeah, that's, that's a robot right there. Um, I don't have a lot of interest in guys or gorillas. I don't like them at all. That's why I look over there just a bit further. Okay, this is, so, okay, this is like a more, um, an artistic er, version of what, uh, Gyako did in Kimetsu no Yaiba. You know, for those of you that have read Kimetsu no Yaiba, you know exactly what I'm talking about with Gyako when he put the swordsman, um, the sword, swords craftsman, like, in that, like, statue pose, and he, and it was just, oh, that was just so fucked up, and it is called art. He called that shit art. It was messed up. This is fucked up, yes, but is this, like, more, just, is this, like, the level of sadism I want in this arc, considering the warning we got last week? No. Help! They're still alive. No. Oh, yeah. This is definitely, definitely a less artistic slash classy version of what Gyako did. Oh, it's not like they can be helped anyways. I'm not helping you log out. And even if you do log out, you're pretty much down in the real world, too. You jerk. If you let them um, log out, then uh, I don't get to see their last moments. That's no good. Or as I say, that's no good. <laughs> I can't resist. They're dead. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We, uh, oh, God. Really, Mashima, is this all you're going to bring to the table for the sadism? Because I want more. I, um, I, I need more. And this is like nothing compared to what we saw what happened in Fairy Tale with that sadism. But anyway. Well, then, it looks like self introductions were out of place. I'm Jamaroff, a selected player, a winner in real life, good friends with the Dragon Job. Yeah. So, I still think it was um, Jamaroff that uh, hacked the system, but like part of me thinks Joe got involved too, but we'll have to see. Dragon Joe? Do you know him? One of the top warriors of this universe, one of the six galactic demon generals that are said to destroy worlds. What's wrong with you? You flinched? Sorry, what's wrong with you? You flinched? You flinched, didn't you? I like that, seeing a girl's face in horror. <laughs> it doesn't matter whose friend you are. You won't be left unpunished. Ooh, that's it. Ooh, the, ooh. I love it. I love Shihido gives zero fucks about this. Um, Hermit's broken soul. What's the, the key to unlocking it? Ziggy, you're a liar. Even if there is a soul in the machine, human beings have no soul. What? Huh? I'm confused by this. Ziggy, like... Or, I, I should say not Ziggy. I should say Hermit. Hermit, what the fuck are you thinking, yo? Oh, God. Some humans don't have a soul. But, yeah, I can understand why she... It's probably... It's probably because of this motherfucker that... Um, that that's why she's feeling this way. But, um, this chapter was good. Um, it really reminded me of Kimetsu no Yaiba. It, um, it reminded me of Gyaku in particular. And um, if you're going to go off that, um, Mashima, if you're going to be inspired by Kimetsu no Yaiba and be inspired by Katoge sadism, which is awesome. I love the sadism in Kimetsu no Yaiba. It is, it, if you want to see sadism, go, go read that shit. But it is, oh God, I love that manga so much. 
Um, but if you want to go that route, like, go for it. I feel like, like, this is, like, nothing. This better be just, like, the tip of the iceberg of the sadism. I, I'm, I'm not even a sadist, and I just, like, I like seeing authors, like, push themselves um, beyond their limits and beyond, you know, what they're used to doing. And we've been seeing this with Mashima throughout all of Eden Zero and Fairy Tale 100 Years Quest. And I just really am hoping that, like, we're going to go, like, we got a warning that we were going to be sadistic. I want full-on sadism up in here. Um, anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And, um, Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive, there's a few ways you could do that. You can donate to my PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something on my Amazon wishlist, all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, friend me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye!